Hi all, welcome to my channel. I'm Mark. This is Mark's Mod, and today we have Ecto Monday, everybody. And we are going to be doing issue 67 of the Ecto One, and it is more electrics today, guys. Uh, we get to find out if these electrics are going to continue to behave with me, or if we're going to have a serious problem. So, um, I've got everything ready. I've read through the magazine quite a bit in depth and everything like that. So, I think I've got an idea of what I'm doing. Fingers crossed. Also watched a few videos on it as well of other people doing it. So I'm really excited to get started with this one. So with all that said, let's get modelling. Okay, so let's get started. Now, what I've done here is these wires that we've already connected up, I've just put them to one side. And here we have all the wires that we're going to be using today. And the first wire we need to look for is wire J. Now wire J came in issue 65, which is this one here. And it's just gonna connect up just like that. And then we need wire 67 J, which we've been given in this issue, which is this one here. And again, we're just gonna make the connection just like that okay the next wire we want is wire 65k so let's get 65k which is this one here and again it's this one here it does it does help it's color coordinated um but then the wires that we're actually adding on to these aren't color coordinated okay so we've done that and the next wire we need is 67k which is this wire here. So we're just going to make that connection. Just like that. Okay. Turn the page of the magazine over. Right. Okay. So the next wire we need is 65H, I do believe. No, nope, sorry, 65L. There's me getting it wrong. So it's this 65L and we're going to plug that in. Now just double checking, I get this in the right way. Okay, that's that one in. And to that we are adding uh, 67L, which is this one here. And this is a bit of a funnier connection, I have to admit, but we're just going to put it together now please note that this does have two bulbs on the end of it as well okay so the next wire we need is 65m 65m yeah 65m apparently have i got these the wrong way around because to me i've got 65e <laughs> hang on a minute uh, we've done 65L, yeah, 65L, that's that one, and we need 65M. Well, all I've got here is E. Let's have a look at this one just in case it's the wrong one. No, that's an N cable. Now if I dunk it at K, yeah, that's only got one bulb coming off it. Done L, yep, yeah, L is matched with L. Now, M. Now it's got an, it's got an N on it, but, ah, oh, there we go, M. Ah. Uh, I'm going to say I did go through all these cables and make sure they were all correct. So there we go, 65M is in place. And then it wants us to put 67M. But this has got an N on it. But hang on, no, wrong, this one. This is the M. I have got my glasses on while I'm doing this. So there's no excuse. <laughs> Okay, so that's M in place now. 
So M, M, yep, okay. Right, we're cooking with gas now. Okay, so what it's saying to us next is we can actually test these lights that we've just done. So we'll switch the car on and it's asking us to push this one here and if we just turn out the light. Oh wow. So we've got these this here which is a, like a white light. There we go. And then we've got these blue ones which are flashing. Isn't that awesome? So just making sure you can get in there. Yeah, that is brilliant. I like that. I really do like that. Just see if I can get them all on camera. There we go. Wow. Okay. So we'll turn that off. And turn the car off. And we'll turn the big light on. Okay. So next what we need to do is, wow. Okay. So now hang on a minute. One's saying one of them should be red and yellow. Hmm, hang on a minute. Let me let's test that again. So let's switch the car on. Switch them lights on. And we should have a red and a yellow. Oh, red. Well, we've got, it's a red and a white, I would say. But it does. Yeah, it does flash. The red light doesn't, but okay, I got myself a little bit confused there. So let's switch them off and switch the car off. And right, so step four is we need cable 65N. Now I do believe that is 65N. And we need to plug this cable in. So plugging it in. Just like that and then we need cable uh, 65N so this is 65N just always double check which way the wires are going round okay so that's 65N uh, the next cable we need is 65N so, which is this one here now this is a little bit more different um, than what we've done before so we've got basically two cables coming off of here as you can see and we need to put these in now it's saying that the shorter cable should go to the switch so let's have a look. Yep. So that's a shorter cable going to the switch. And then off that 65N should be the longer one again, which is going off into a switch. Right, okay. Let's check these then. Plug that in. And now it's saying, uh, so we've done that. So let's have a look. Yeah. Right. So can't we switch the car on? Oh, these have come on. Apparently, you're supposed to be able to. Yeah, like that. You can turn them. Turn them on and off. Let's have a look at this one. Again, you can turn them on and off. Isn't that pretty neat? Put them together. Let's have a look. Yeah, they're lighting up. And this one. And they're lighting up too. Yeah. Put them both on. I love electrics. And as you can see, they're all lit up. Nice little blue colour. Wow. Quite impressed with that. So I wonder what they'll be like with everything lit up that we've done today. So let's turn the light off. As you can see, 
that's quite a yeah a wow moment really wow okay all right and that is this issue complete so that's stage 67 wow so let me turn them lights off let me turn them other lights off at the switches so i don't know yet um so let me just turn the main overhead light on now we have got these two terminals here coming off i don't know what they're for yet they haven't said to us as well as we've got them on there as well so we've got two of the same um i really do not know what they're for now i am conscious that underneath these there's all that solder and these could short if the batteries were on so i'm wondering whether it would just be maybe a little bit practical to put some electrical tape underneath these so these uh, don't get damaged um i think that's definitely something i'm going to have a look at um after the stream but that's issue 67 complete well that's it for uh, ecto monday today everybody that was a really really good build i did really enjoy that um my advice to anybody who's about to tackle that issue make sure you look through all the wires first work them out in the instructions and then do the build because if i hadn't have done that this video could have been a well it could have been a lot longer than what it was planned to be um so yeah i uh, i'm pleased that all worked i've just realized i've got the ecto one still switched on here uh, i need to go switch it off uh, but yeah, I've got a little bit of wire tidy to do as well after uh, this uh, After I've done this video um, Because I hate untidy wires. It's just one of them things uh, But yeah, um, so a couple of things. Uh, it is the 8th tomorrow. So which means uh, my uh, two teenage boys one's back at school one's back at college So I'm able to come in and start doing some daily builds, which I'm really really excited about um, so what my plan is is the videos now will be released at dinner time every day um, for, on the day that they correspond to it. so we've got obviously Ecto on a Monday we've got Terminator on the Tuesday we will have X-Wing on the Wednesday eventually when I get some parts I got some parts but they weren't the parts that I needed it was for the next time um, which I need to ring Diego Stini about and then obviously we've then got uh, the Spitfire on the Thursday and then we've got the DeLorean on the Friday so yeah really looking forward to it so uh, with all that said guys if you like this video please give it a massive thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified of any future videos but as for always guys stay safe and bye for now I'd just like to give a shout out to all my patrons that help and support the channel please check out their channels on YouTube as well and thank you very much for watching